guys, this is James from the Impossible Channel, and we're going to be talking about Flat Earth and ACDC and a lot more actually, okay? So I received an email from this anonymous source telling us that in the Bible, they say, the Bible, God says to follow the compass. You know, there's a passage where somebody says to follow the compass that you will find uh, the true path, you know, to heaven, something like that, you know. And if you if you analyze those kind of things, you know, you try to link them to the dome, to flat earth, they will become easily linked. When you know, for example, when you watch Admiral Byrd's statement telling you that he went to this new continent, to this other continent, when he went beyond the South Pole. Yes, there is. And not up around the North Pole, because it's getting crowded up there now, because they find out it's really usable, not only to live in, but militarily. But strangely enough, there's left in the world today an area as big as the United States that's never been seen by a human being. And that's beyond the pole on the other side of the South Pole. But then again, in the Bible, they're talking about the North Pole, right? Wrong. The North Pole is actually the South Pole, and the South Pole is actually the North Pole. Lately, there have been a lot of articles talking about the mistakes that the geographical institutions, and not only that, NASA and many agencies have been telling us the opposite on purpose because the Bible says that if you follow north you will find this special place right so what if you do what if you get your compass right now and you follow what the the compass tells you is north you know what I mean right so that's gonna lead you to this special place the Bible says right wrong because probably they're they're writing that north is actually south they're inverting it you know what I mean so what if the North Pole is actually the South Pole, right? Then we would have to go into ACDC's last concert where they actually play a show, you know, they make this whole, whole entire show uh, in Antarctica and they have this passageway to hell, you know, it's like highway to hell has all along been telling us that they have been going to this place out of or out of the dome or in this outer continent where Admiral Byrd states he's been to. Not only that, we have the guitarist here, we have the guitar man, right? In, during the show, in, in ACDC's last show, he's using a hat with, uh, with an A, right? It could be because of his name. And he's pointing the there's a moment in the show where he's actually pointing to the way out of the earth you know out of the dome and it's impressive how many clues these guys have been trying to give us and we're like not seeing them you know we have been disinformation all along we have been like disinfoed all this time into believing things and we have you know, believed these things and, and we have been led to, I believe we have been led to the wrong place. So again, we have um, flat, we have ACDC's last show in 2016. We have to remember that they are in Antarctica, they are in this ice place, and there's hell right after, right? There's a passageway and hell right after. So um, this is just incredible, you know. They, they, are they like? Are we on the brink of someone actually opening up the the, the portal? Uh, you know, uh, could this be? Any, you know, like what about CERN? C E R N, the L H C project, right? What about CERN? Are they trying to open these portals? You know what I mean? Are they trying to? You know shake the pillars that hold our earth well according to the bible at least so this is all very 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 intriguing i think that this acdc show is just a wake-up call you know we it's incredible we don't know if this could be a sign probably is again we have 
the guitar man showing us the way to out out of here you know and he's using a hat wearing the a which could be his name you know which could be re representing his name or which could be representing the solomon seal antarctica these organizations that that keep this uh this portal you know this passageway to hell or heaven um closed right and i, th I think they, they're trying to show us something here okay now uh if we begin with the bible right the bible says that if we follow the compass the bible says that if we follow the compass that we will find a way to a special place What special place could this be right now what special place could this be we have in the old very old ancient mythologies we have Shambhala you know we have this city underground city in Tibet you know uh, it's just if you look at it isn't this flat earth right isn't this the way the world we live in but we live in the round part the other parts we're not allowed to go into right and we have this thousand year old buddhist map that was found that was actually revealed revealed something very similar to this shambhala drawing right so you know what i mean like we have a round we have the south pole as a round circle keeping us inside the circle and we have this outer structure which we don't know how you know we don't know the format but we know there are other continents and in shambhala we can see that there is a circle and this outer part right so we could be talking about the whole picture now not only that we'll take a look at this i'm going to read here in tibet we have an autobiography from uh this lama t lobsang rampa the novel is called the third eye and he speaks about visiting a remarkable underground structure such as caves and created by man in, in nature and underground cavities that lead that led him to a palace and this is all beneath the residence of the Dalai Lama you know now passing through countless underground corridors halls and stairways he went to a huge place and at the center of this place was a black house its walls were covered with strange symbols and diagrams and inside the house there were three open sarcophagus made of black stone decorated with paintings and mysterious inscriptions now take a look one of the abbots pointing to those who lay in the sarcophagus said i'm gonna read what was written what was what he said what he said he saw in one of these sarcophagus it was written my son look upon these they were gods in our lands and in the days before the mountains came in the days before the mountains came they walked our country when seas washed our shores and when different stars went in the sky look for none but initiates have seen these so this is just very you know wow a lot of information right so we may be living in a dome where gods you know recreate and create as they will you know okay um so the question is is a cdc trying to point that out for us you know like in 2016 finally you know like all these years we never understood their song highway to hell and now they're finally trying to point it out you know so thank you very much for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe comment below share and see you again
Yeah.